most holy and gracious Father. Father, of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, we give thy name all praise and glory. We exalt you, Father God. We thank you for Jesus Christ. We thank you for the blessed Holy Spirit. Father, as we touch and agree in spirit, we ask, Lord God, the blessings that we, Lord God, will be allowed to stand in the gap for others this morning. We pray that as you look down upon us, Father God, that there is no hindrance to our prayers, that our prayers, Lord God, hallelujah, will come forth as a sweet aroma unto you. We want to pray, Lord God, that thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. We want to pray, Lord God, for our sisters and our brothers that are going through, Lord God, infirmities. We pray, merciful Lord, deliverance right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God, you are the God that healeth thee. You, Lord God, are the God that opened the eyes of the blind. You are the God, Lord God, hallelujah, that declares, merciful Father, that all sickness is not unto death, but to the glory of your name. And Father, we thank you. We thank you right now. Father God, you know, Lord God, our church families that are on their sick bed right now. Father, we ask right now that you touch, touch them, Lord God. We decree and declare thy healing through the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We thank you, Lord God, that we stand, merciful Lord, on the word of God. It's Lord God, we know that Jesus died. He, Lord God, bore our sicknesses on his body. He took, Lord God, our sicknesses on his body. That, Lord God, that we through faith would receive his, his health and his healing. And we thank you right now, Lord God, for the manifestation of wholeness upon the bodies, Lord God, and the minds, Father God, that stand in need of healing this morning. Father, we thank you. We pray, Lord God, for our sisters and brothers that have lost loved ones this week. We ask, Lord God, that you comfort them. Strengthen them, Lord God, as they go about making arrangements. Open doors for them, Lord God. Merciful Lord, that, hallelujah, Lord God, that everything will fall in place. And that they will, Lord God, declare your goodness and your mercy. Hallelujah, Lord God, that you've already gone before them to to make a way. Father, we thank you right now and we give you praise. Father, we want to pray for those that are dealing with COVID right now. Father, we thank you for the healing over their bodies in the mighty name of Jesus. We thank you for the strengthening, Lord God, of their immune systems. Hallelujah, Lord God. We just give it to you Father, we know that a hallelujah, that all, Lord God, praise God, that there is a time that you have declared that, Lord God, that all of this, this virus, Lord God, all of it, Lord God, would be declared and sent back to the pits of hell 
We thank you for it right now. We know, Lord God, that there is a day because you told us, Lord God, hallelujah, there is a season for everything. Lord God, we thank you right now. And we declare, Lord God, this season of healing, this season, Lord God, that you would allow your children to come together, hallelujah, and to worship you in the beauty of holiness in the temple of God. We thank you, we give you praise. We pray a blessing over Pastor Thomas. We ask, Lord God, that you strengthen him. Keep him in your keeping care. Father God, we thank you and we give you all praise and glory. And as we depart from one another, we thank you, Lord God, hallelujah, for going and traveling with us, Lord God, that the angels have been camped round about us, waiting, Lord God, hallelujah, Father God. The angels are just waiting, praise God, for the traveling mercies, merciful Father, we thank you. We thank you. We pray a blessing over our families. Father God, we thank you. We put them in your hands. In Christ Jesus' name we pray. Let the church say amen. 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 And amen. amen.